If you're watching this, then I guess that you love biology just as much as I do, or maybe you know someone who does. So I'm gonna be going through with you some of the top biology related gifts you could give to someone for Christmas, whether it's a mini Christmas gift, secret Santa, or you just wanna treat yourself. So I'm gonna go through with you all of the gifts that get the Miss Estrick seal of approval, which basically means I already own it and love it, or it's on my wish list. So let's go through some of those top gifts so you can see what to get your friends, family, or yourself. Number one is the Giant Microbe Toys. And if you haven't heard of these, it's a brand that does lots of like toys about this size of different biological microbes, but also different structures. So I've got these three. I've got the heart, DNA molecule, and the brain, and I love them so much. They come with these little cards attached to them with information, so the biology behind it, but then they've also got like a bit of personality, so give them eyes. They're really soft, cuddly, and cute. But what I use them for, well, pre-COVID, what I use them for before I didn't have to worry about sharing things too much, I used to throw them out into the class and whoever had the toy would answer the question and they'd throw the toy on someone else and it would go like that all the way around. But now they just sit at the front of my classroom and students come up and have a look at them. But if you are a teacher and want to use it for that, or if you're looking for a present for a teacher, I promise you they will love it if they're anything like me, or just for you, they are amazing. So although I've got those three, I had a little look on Amazon, and here's the range that they have at the moment. So I am definitely wanting to get another one. Put in the comments which one you think I should get next. Number two, I'm gonna go through with you a few different types of jewelry that I found that link to biology. So the first one I'm actually modeling already because I actually own these earrings. So let me do a little close up. There we go, so hopefully you can see those. Those are my DNA earrings, which I was actually given as a secret Santa present last year from someone at school, and I love them. Whenever I wear them at school, I always make sure I've got my hair tied up, because if my hair's down, you don't really see them. So when it's up, people see them, and I always notice students are staring at me, and I'm like, oh my gosh, I must have something on my face, they're all staring. And then they're like, oh, I like your earrings. So there we go, definitely hit these earrings. So if you, again, are looking for a present for a teacher, for you, um, or for a friend, these are awesome. I'll link all of these gifts in the description as well. So if you do want to get any of the exact same ones, then you can check those out. I've also found a matching necklace to go with it. Now I don't have this yet. This is one of the things that would be classed as on my wish list because I love these earrings so much. I wanted to find a matching DNA necklace and on the Etsy site where I found these, um, I actually didn't find a matching necklace. So I looked on Amazon and I found this matching necklace. So if you want to get the full set or just one or the other, then I love these. Okay, and the final one, I don't know if you saw my TikTok, I don't know when it was now, a week, two weeks ago, um, and it featured this pin. Let me just get you so you can see this pin might be backwards for you that um but this pin is of a mitochondria and it says i've got the power this actually lives on my lanyard that i wear to school every day and um i got it as a birthday present from the science department so all the teachers bought it for me for my birthday and i love it and it turns out tiktok love it as well so that one video has had um, over half a million views now of people answering a biology question that was on there but also people saying that they love the pin and they want to know where to get it from. So I've linked that one here. If you want a lanyard pin, or it can be a pin on a badge, jump up, wherever, that I've got the power mitochondria one is awesome. But yes, let's clarify this as loads of people brought it up on TikTok. The mitochondria is not the powerhouse of the cell. It's the site of aerobic respiration. So let's not get that misconception embedded because of a pin. The next category that I'm gonna go through is biology related clothing. And yet again, Etsy came up trumps for me for this. I was actually just searching biology. Well, I think I just searched biology full stop because I wanted to get some ideas of things I could buy for my office. And I came across these jumpers. So this first one, which is a labeled neuron. That is definitely on my wish list. It's gonna be the next jumper I buy for sure because I love it so much. It is full on geek mode though. I mean, you do have that full diagram of a neuron and the labels. You can pick the different colors though. I quite like the gray though. Um, but if you do love biology and you wanna shout about it, that's a great jumper. 
If you want something a little bit more subtle, I did also find this one here where you've got half the brain, half flowers. So, you know, it's still biology related, but not quite so in your face. I love biology. A bit more subtle if you want to go for that sort of vibe. Now, for my hardcore Miss Estrick biology fans, some of you will know already that this exists, some of you won't, but you can actually get this epic jumper. Okay, let me show you. So these hoodies are Miss Estrick Biology hoodies and I absolutely love mine. It is so soft. I actually bought it, first of all, just as when they came out, I wanted a tester and this was my favorite type of the hoodies, but there's a whole range of them that you can get. And this color I liked, but also it was really soft and warm. So if you are looking for, I mean, let's be realistic. It's probably gonna be a joke present if you get this, or like I said, you are a hard core fan, or there's a bit of nostalgia if you're now at university. But this would be a great secret Santa present if you do want something a bit tongue in cheek. But it's not just the hoodies. If you want something, the hoodies are the more expensive product. But if you did want something cheaper, there's loads of little Miss Estrick Bargy stickers as well, which are only a couple of pounds. So I'll link all of that below if you are after a Miss Estrick type of gift. The next category is the study gear. So some of this is like really biology related. Some of it is more just stationary that I love. And I'm going to start with this pad. I absolutely love a pad and I can't even tell you how many pads I have on the go at one time. So I'll find one and because people know I love pads, I normally get at least two or three for my birthday and at Christmas and normally for Secret Santa. And I love that. I'm not saying that's a bad thing. I love it because I am a sucker for a really nice pad. And then I think, well, I'm just going to use this one because I love it. But then I use this one and I end up losing everything. I should really have a pad for different things, but I've now come across this pad with all of these white blood cells on um, and all the different things to do with the immune system. And I really, really want it. And if you're anything like me and you love biology, this is gonna be a great pad for your biology notes. It could be what you're writing in class. It could be where you write all your answers to past paper questions. It could be your blurting book. This one is great. The next thing I found was this pencil holder, which also doubles up as a plant holder. There's actually someone in biology who has um, something quite similar where I teach. And I was trying to find a version of it because I loved it so much. And I came across this one. And whether you're someone that might know what a virus looks like or not, I think it's still a pretty cool just shape anyway. So I think those are a great gift for anyone that loves sciences or any kind of geometry or viruses. Although I'm not sure how many people love viruses, maybe studying them. Either way, I think those are really cool. The next thing is what you could use to jazz up your notes a bit. If you want to make your either pencil case, your lanyard, your revision note, your folder, a little bit more themed towards biology, this is for you. There are so many stickers here that you could do the works with it. I love the range that they have and they've got so many good reviews. So if you are after some biology themed stickers, that is the one. And they're not too expensive, so that's good too. A great idea for a secret Santa present. Okay, a little coffee break. Which brings me on to the next one. I don't know if you've ever seen in any of my Instagram or on YouTube, but I basically use this mug every day all year round and it drives some people absolutely nuts because it is a Christmas mug. But I don't know if you're like me, but I'm very particular about the thickness, the size, and this mug is just perfect. So I use it all year round. But if you do like to have different mugs, then I have come across this one here. It is to do with antibodies, but I quite like the way that the design is watercolors. So it's more artistic. And I feel it's the kind of design that would get people asking like, oh, what's that a picture of? And then cue you going in, telling them all about biology. So that is a really great option if you are looking for a mug to give as a gift, or if you want your own mug to replace one that you've already got. Now the next ones are still study year, but I'm gonna say they're probably quite specific for maybe anyone that might want to go into medicine, or maybe you already used to follow me and now you are studying medicine. But I found a few cool things here. The first thing that I've got is this skeleton. Now I actually found it, again, cause I was looking for just things to decorate my science office with. And I'm not obviously going to be studying medicine, but I just quite like this as a little prop to have on my front bench. 
And there is actually another biology teacher at school who has a wooden skeleton, which is similar in um, idea to this, and it looks so cool. And she's got a little Christmas hat on it at the moment. I'll have to see if I can get a picture of it and have that edited into this video so I can show you that. I also love this really miniature little torso of a human. We have like big scales of this at school where you can take out the organs, try and put it back, um, and just test your knowledge of organs. Again, this could just be a, like, a little cute stocking filler that could be given someone that you know likes science, or it could be an actual educational gift as well. So that's a nice one to have that isn't too expensive. If you're looking for a bit more of a sophisticated, arty present, I would recommend these. And I actually had this on my own personal wish list, and I've transferred over to the biology wish list to talk about in this video. So again, I was looking at um, inside my own home office and I wanted to have biology very obvious in my home office. So I was looking for some art that I could use that was biology related and I came across these and I really like just how simple they are, but they're really striking also. So if you are into biology and you want to decorate your room or you might want to, it comes as a pack, but you could always give them as separated presents to different teachers or different friends. Or if you're heading to university or you know someone at university, great present for them to decorate their room um, in halls or wherever they are at uni. You also might have noticed there's a little black tail here. That is BB. She has come in to see what is going on. Here. Oh, gonna pick her up, but she ran off. I think she got worried that I was advertising her as a gift. BB is not for sale, she is mine. Now the next one I have actually ordered for myself already. As you just saw, I'm gonna try and keep it um, anonymous so you're not actually seeing all the details of my school, but there is my school lanyard. It's a little bit ropey now, it's a bit broken, it's a bit dirty, I need a new one. And I came across this biology related one and so many doctors and nurses are using this based on the reviews and they love it. So I've already ordered one, I'm gonna be getting myself that. If you have to wear a lanyard at school and you can get away with it being different colors, it would be great. Next, I have some gifts for a few of you. You might have seen on my Instagram right at the start of December that I told you I was filming a YouTube video about something to do with Christmas. This is the one. And I said, if you have any shout outs that you would like to have as a little freebie Christmas present to someone that you know, then let me know. Well, now is the time and I have got a range of shout outs that I'm gonna fire through so that you can share this with all the people that you wanted to say happy Christmas and thank you to this year. And I'm gonna start with my own students at school because quite a few of them commented saying, uh, are you gonna do a shout out to us or not? So the answer is yes, shout out to all of the students that I teach at my school. I hope you have a really great break and a happy Christmas. Not only that, I had a couple of the teachers at my school requesting a shout out. So Mr. Lee, have a great Christmas. Next up, I'd love to say happy Christmas to Mrs. Brace. Your students are absolutely loving biology because of you. So they wanted me to share with you that you are an amazing teacher. They wanted to say happy Christmas. And also thank you for being such a huge fan and sharing my content with them. Next, we have a request for all of the biology teachers at high stores in Sheffield. And as someone that used to teach in Sheffield, Sheffield has a special place in my heart. So I'm gonna throw in a bonus one to all the teachers at Silverdale School as well. Next up, we have a shout out to Miss Vigela and Miss Huckabee at Camp. We have a shout out to the biology class 13.1 we have a shout out to at holly siggin who is an amazing teacher and really helps her year 13s to understand mr hedich and mrs morgan mrs ollerton mrs brett mrs lomas who apparently has been teaching for over 22 years which is incredible those are all the shout out requests that i've had come in before i filmed this if you did submit it afterwards i'm so sorry but you missed the cutoff but also a big shout out to all of you who've been following me who subscribe and make this channel possible now if you are in the shopping mood after this but you want to get something maybe a bit more practical that you know is going to super boost your grades then i recommend you check out this video next i go through all of the top resources that you could use to help you to get an a star in a level biology but for now have a great Christmas everyone and I will see you in the new year